Magandang gabi, Fufinas. Welcome to Japanese Shoe Channel. Today, I'm going to watch tourism videos about Cebu City 2022. Wow! Um, I really like uh, instead love uh, Cebu City because uh, I have lots of beautiful memories in Cebu City especially Moabo Cebu we saw sunset uh, at coast side at the bar and it was so memorable uh, moment for me because my trip to the Philippines is usually for business trip so I've never encountered such a beautiful beach so I hope I can go to the Moalbo Cebu again but uh, let's see what's inside uh, MUPH 2022 tourism videos Cebu City Yo! okay before watching the video please subscribe to my channel don't forget to push the notification bell to not to miss my future videos if you like the video please share it to your friends and family members thank you very much Saramapo okay let's go Cebu is alive because of its stories to tell. Oh. It's worth So she's also probably well. one candidate of Miss Universe. Our story begins with artist Levy, who is a storyteller herself. Hmm. Levy is most known for her comics and masterpieces through the lens of a modern Cebu. Oh, so she is an Levy artist. Levy embodies the quintessential Cebuana. Highlighted by her Pusok tattoo. Commonly known mm -hmm. here as hanging oh, rice. Unique tattoo. Pusok is not just food for the body, uh -huh. but food for the soul. The combination of art, culture, and culinary, mm -hmm. all in one person. The hallmark characteristic of a Cebuano is her faith and... Yeah, so this is Majoran's cross. Yeah, I went there and uh, I explored around this area and there, you know, many vendors are selling uh, souvenirs and also there's a lot of souvenir shop. But this one, this one is, this one I bought in SM Cebu, so not to, around this area. And devotion to Senor Santo Nino. Stemming from the Cebuano word Sulo, meaning current of the water. The Sinulog dance consists of two steps forward and one step back. Nanay Flor is a living testament of that. She is She's very tall. Her life to keeping the current of faith ever flowing. Breaking stereotypes and glass ceilings, Jahan D has defied the status quo transcending gender roles and becoming a trailblazer for young Cebuano talent. At the tender age of 30, Jahan already has her own architecture firm, making her the blueprint for career-driven women in male-dominated industries. These stories are woven and interconnected into the colorful tapestry that is our community. Our soul, our hearts, our stories. Cebu. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Where's more for Cebu? I thought. Ah, uh, so uh, I understand. Yeah. Sorry, I misunderstood. Because I thought. I. I I associated more ball with Cebu, but uh, it's not in Cebu City. Oh, I see. So that's why <laughs> there's nothing, nothing about more ball. <laughs> yeah, true, true. Yeah, <laughs> the more ball is not part of Cebu City. <laughs> I understand. 
Okay, okay, okay. So, yeah. Yeah, actually, well, in Cebu City, yeah, so Santonino Church, that、uh, Magellan's Cross, and Fort San Pedro is historical place in Cebu City. And aside from that, there's not so m- There's not, there's none, none aside from those three historical place or feature in Seb City. Yeah, they, they have a urbanized place like art, IT Park, but uh, uh, yeah, so in a way, no feature about that. No, no feature in Seb City. Yeah, just to develop the place. <laughs> Oh, I see. I got it. Okay. <laughs> today's, today's video is it. That's my reaction for tourism video for Seb City.、Um, please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to push the notification bell to not to miss my future videos. If you like the video, please share it to your friends and family members. Also, please leave comments below, whatever you want. Thanks for watching the video.、Uh, see you again. Sum up. <laughs>